Hey, hey, hey guys, welcome back to Final Fantasy IV Pixel Remaster, where we are here back in the overworld, real world, well, I don't know, but we got the Falcon with the weird screwdriver on it. <laughs> in the last episode, we obviously finished fa uh, exploring the underworld, and we found Yang, but he's a sea, but I don't really know what to do, but I have had a thought, we're going to go obviously speak to the priest, but then we're going to go find his wife, because she, didn't she say something about, you know, make sure you look after him, so I'm going to go speak to her and see whether something happens, because it's got to be something to do with Yang, I feel like anyway. But we're here in Mystia, where the, um, that guy, <laughs> we knew you would return. Please join us at the Tower of Worship. Oh, and thank you guys so much for watching me play. I do appreciate it ever so much, and please subscribe if you have not. And we're gonna keep the story going now, so one born of a dragon, bearing darkness and light, will rise to the heavens over the still land. The moon's light eternal brings a promise to earth with bounty and grace. That's the same one it said before, isn't it? That's not a new one, right? I'm pretty sure he's already told me that. Everyone, let us pray. Now is the time to make the legend come true. Oh, oh, do we need like a sacrifice or something as well? You know. <laughs> Uh, okay, right, what, uh, what the hell, okay, look, our prayers, they have been answered, how have they been answered, okay, all the colours have changed, that wasn't me, ah, it's a shark, no, it's not a shark, <laughs> the, what is that? What the? Oh my god! Oh, oh no no no! That means is that mean it's going evil? Usually when things that happen like that on Final Fantasy, it means it's going evil. There is no doubt that is the great and glorious vessel itself, the Luna Whale. Uh, okay. You just stop with the glowing thing. It's really freaky. Ah! A strange voice addressed me during our prayers. He told me you were to fly to the moon and someone awaits you there. But how can we possibly get there? On the lunar whale, according to our ancient Mystian documents, there is a crystal inside the ship that allows navigation between here and the moon. We must communicate with it. I'll see what I can do. <laughs> uh, okay. What the hell? Um, what? Rest? Okay. Good night. Whoa. Good night. <laughs> What's that? Okay, I wasn't really expecting that. Uh, oh. Oh, okay, that's how you get off the ship. Oh, sorry, I came back on the other side. Ah. No! Oh! No, I didn't want to go to the moon! No, we're going to the moon! <gasps> we're going to the moon, guys! Not what I meant to do, but we've gone to the moon! Wow, okay. Uh, can I go back to Earth then? Is that how I go back to Earth? <laughs> oh guys how cool is that okay all right okay that's uh, very cool <laughs> I was so confused about what's going on uh, so where's Fable? where is Fable? I can't remember where Fable is uh, I've gone past Fable at the time where is Fable? Fable Castle, oh, it's there. Okay. This airship's so much quicker. Alright, let's go up here to Fable. Here we go. No, 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 okay, I can't quite land on top of them. <laughs> let's go see Yang's wife. I love how it's kind of like, 
there's just this ancient technology that's awesome just lying around that people don't know. Uh, and then she was up. Where is she? She's up the West Tower, I think. This one? This one? Oh, it's a shop. <laughs> but at least I've got somewhere I can rest for free now rather than paying the extortionate, extortionate prices. Uh, I feel like that's not. Ah, maybe this is the way. No. Is there anything in the crystal room now? No, oh, okay. Uh, I'm a bit lost, if I'm honest, guys. <laughs> I do like the music in here, though. It's like, bang! Right, so it's not in. So it must be from here. How do I get. How do I get out? Okay, fine, fine, fine. No. What? So there's that door there. How do I get into that door? It must be here. Is it behind me here? Oh, there we go. <laughs> I completely forgot where I was going. So I'm pretty sure Yang's wife was up here. I'm pretty sure this is Yang's wife. Come again? My husband's in the underworld? Why does he come home? I'm not crying. I just have something in my eye. Here, take this. Give that a no good smack on the noggin for me. <laughs> okay. Okay, so I guess we're going to go have to go see Yang again. Oh, I apologize. This is obviously a little bit of a, a repeat of the last episode. But, you know, it, it feels like a side quest that I've got to do. To me, it seems like this will be important. Let's get back in my little fishy. <laughs> Shouldn't go at the fishy. Um, okay. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, there's nothing over there. Uh, ooh, ooh, cave. Um, oh, no. Well, I can't. Oh, I can't land. Um, ooh, I can go get the Enterprise. I can go this way. And get the uh, hovercraft. Yeah, yeah. So we're gonna go do. Should be down here, shouldn't it? I think I left it here. Ah, the, the tower's still there at least. Still glowing like anything. Okay, then. Well, there's the Enterprise. Ah, oh, there's the hovercraft. So it is. Uh, this little bit's a bit annoying. I have to admit. You know, you've got to come out of it like that. Reminds me of the Enterprise. Oh, great. Oh my god, the enemies have all upped their game a little bit. A little bit, not massively. Pretty sure I didn't get these enemies before. Did I? No. Oh, I'm just gonna, I'm basically, I'm just waiting for Cecil and Edge to come back around. And then they'll just rinse them. Bang, you're dead. Bang, you're dead. Go. Uh, so I now need to go get this. And then we gotta go back. Oh, it's a nice little episode of exploring though today, guys. I'm quite enjoying this. Uh, I like how they've suddenly got some more quests in uh, in, the, in the game. Uh, it won't land on there, will it? Uh. Do this. Put this over there. Okay, and then if I land over here. Right, there we go. Get in my little hover. Oh, I can't. Oh, you, 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 you've got to be kidding me. Sorry. Okay, so I can probably land over there then. I'm guessing. Are you going to let me put it down there? There you are. Are you going to let me off there then? Okay, that's even better. Let's go see this cave. Adamant Grotto. Dad found an unusual ore here, but he'd rather find a rare animal tail. He collects well I beat it. I'll only touch you when you bring me a tail. How about this? This is the rat tail I've been looking for. Alright, here's some ore in return. Wahey! 
That's great. <laughs> Okay, let's go all the way back. So the adamantium. Oh my God, that guy! He uh, said he would give me um, the ultimate sword or something, didn't he? If I had it. <gasps> yes, let's go get the lunar whale again. Here we are. We're about parts. Here we go. Oh no. Sorry, that's my bad. I can't believe that basically the whole getting the hovercraft thing was just to do one, two little things now. And one of them was more of a fluke that I've just worked <laughs> that one out. Uh, okay, let's go find... Can I just go back in the hole? Is it here? There we go. Oh. Wait. Is the, is the Luna... Is the Luna whale too big? Will it not go? Do, Oh my god, the fact you've got to swap between all the... the oh god. This is a bit stupid. And not, I'm not sure about this, guys, if I'm honest. Right, if this goes back in now, it's just really stupid. Yeah, like that. <laughs> okay, now we're going to go to that smithy. He was down here. Unfortunately, you can't cross the planet nicely. Uh, yeah, there we go. Give me the sword, give me the sword! Uh, he was this dude up here, wasn't it? He said he'll only wake up for it. My smithing days are until I find the legendary, yeah. Adamantium, give me that old sword, I'll give it a new life! I know the sword of legend! <laughs> ba 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 ba! Ready the holy sword at Excalibur. Use it well. Bum, 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 bum. That is definitely going to go to, to Cecil. There is no messing around there. Excalibur. What did the. Oh my god, his defense. His attack is absolutely mental now. <laughs> I got the Excalibur. Okay, so we're going to go just quickly go back to Yang. Oh. Oops. Uh, I don't think these guys are very strong. I've already thought of my name for this episode, guys. I know I'm a bit ahead of practice, because there could be something crazy that's about to happen. But I'm thinking, Excalibur and the frying pan. <laughs> or the frying pan and Excalibur? I don't know, I feel like Excalibur and the frying pan sounds better. Okay. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, so now we're going to have to go back to see Yang. Go in that horrible dungeon again. I don't think there's any quick way through. Nope. I was hoping there'd be like some s shortcut that just appeared. Okay. Uh, yeah, come on. This one's down there. I've got to try and remember the way to go, guys. Down this one. Oops. Just, I know I'm probably I'm running the risk of getting hurt, but I'm just like, well, it's only a couple of steps, and I can probably just survive. <laughs> Quake. Especially when I can just do a cure now. Then I'll kill them all off, hopefully. Oh, what? One survive, no! Big. Edge leveled up. This is a really good way to get levels though, I have to admit. Yeah, no, no, come down. Okay, now we're gonna obviously do that. Magic Rosa. Float, and then all the way up to the top. Oh! Uh, kill them. Kill oh no! You knew that he had. You knew that. Quay. Okay, we'll okay, just do. Zuna on yourself. I don't even know if that would be very effective against Marlboros. Yeah, that worked quite well. 
<laughs> then you just berserk it. <laughs> oh, sometimes these enemies are so stupid. Um, I'm going to use Cecil's own magic. And then it's, it's the way at the top. Yeah. Aha! So, okay, so it's actually not that hard to get to if you're just trying to get to it. In comparison to obviously what I was doing in the last episode, which was just. Ah! Sorry. Panic! <laughs> oh no! I thought that was going to be Cecil. Oops, that was stupid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That breath, okay, okay. Attack, and attack. It's fine, we'll just kill it, we'll just kill it. And the aim is just to kill it. Oh wow, go reader. Go reader, and you leveled up. Awesome. Wasn't really expecting that. Okay, she's back. And then, let's just get in quick, 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 quick. Yes. You find him like, okay, all right, fine. Frying pan! Hey, stop! <laughs> ah, is it time for training? Allow me to sleep a little more. <laughs> Cecil? Yang! I'm so glad you're awake! The Sylph saved my life. Well, you saved us by destroying the cannons! I shall join you once again. You must rest. I cannot rest when my friends risk their lives. Just take it easy. You are? I'm Edge of Eblon. Don't worry, I can fill you in. Eblon, so you are a ninja, but I must. No, we'll fight in your place instead. She's a summoner, correct? Then she may call upon us at any time. Thank you. Rita has learned Sylph. Okay, so is that what the whole point of this was? I am most grateful. Okay, we're going to go tell your wife then. It was so violent. What if Yang dies? Okay, they all like Yang, they fancy Yang. We'll take care of Yang. I mean, you can take care of him. I'm a bit worried about what his wife's gonna say. Okay, I'm just gonna, oh God, I'm just gonna get a battle going. <laughs> uh, summon, cast Whisper Wind, which absorbs an enemy HP to all allies. Okay, we'll just kill these ones. Oh, 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 don't, don't attack that. Whisper wind! Oh, wow! Oh my god, it actually it can kill them as well. Wow, that's really good. And I think what's best is I've got a new way of healing. Potentially as well, from that. If, if like, um, Rosa and Cecil are struggling, then maybe Rita can help. Oh! That is awesome, guys. Now let's just go tell his wife. This might not be so fun. <laughs> okay, all the way back. I keep forgetting I can go off the side of the world. Oh, I'm, clearly, I'm clearly a flat earther in disguise. <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> okay, so this time I remember where to go. Up and then round. Ba -ba -ba -bam. Up the stairs, then up again. Uh, I'll give her the frying pan back. Thanks for everything. Here, this might come in handy. See the knife. Tell him not to worry about me. You should concentrate on getting better so he can help you all. I don't think he was actually worried about you. So am I not going to get Yang back? I might not get Yang back. That's uh, disappointing, isn't it? Okay, okay, right. Uh, no, wait, that wasn't the right way, was it? Okay, well, we're going to go fly up to the moon, I think, now. We'll go see what's going on on the moon. Uh, then maybe that's where we'll end the episode. Only a shortish one today. Because I, I feel like the moon probably deserves its own sort of episode. Because that's like where they're like final dungeon that's going to be, isn't it? Because we've explored the rest of the world. 
So unless I have to go back into the Tower of Babel for like a third? Fourth time? I don't know. Let's go, let's go! Oh wait, no, no, no. It's not the, not the button I want. <gasps> Guys, we're going to the moon! Oh, woof! And we're off! We're off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of the moon. <laughs> okay. So, what the hell are we looking for? Okay, can I just land wherever I want? Okay. Yeah. Aha, I can land on here. Okay, let's go in this cave. Let's just see what's in this cave. We'll work out what's happening on the moon. I don't know, maybe this is like a... I don't know. I don't know how strong enemies are going to be on here either. Cave of... Oh my god, I think maybe we'll, uh, we'll wait for that one. The cave of Bahamut. He must be the god of summons. Oh, okay. So far, the enemy is not that bad. Oh, okay. This this seems this seems survivable. Maybe I shouldn't have gone where I went. I don't know. I mean, <laughs> maybe I actually um, went. Whoa, whoa! Where did they get that sort of damage from? Okay, let's just... So we, we've found the Cave of Barma. Good to know. We will probably do a special episode just for that, I reckon. Can I go all the way off? Have I just gone all the way off? Wait, well, Oh, I can. Okay, right, so... Um, oh my god. Uh, oh, I have no idea where I'm going. Too many places. Oh my god, there's too many places I can't really see anything. Okay, right, let's just uh, get in here. Let's just get them all on the map, shall we? See, see what's happening. Humming way home. Wait, these are the guys, the naming way guys, aren't they? Are these the naming way guys? Mm hmm. And then these now hum. <laughs> hum, hum. <laughs> Well, how do I... No, go away, you. Go away, you. I don't like you. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Long ago, one of our people built an airship and traveled to the Blue Planet. He was adept at naming things. <laughs> mm hmm We are the Hummingways. Really? Never would have guessed. Oh! Oh, okay, we just... Buy some items. Whistle for calling fat... Alarm that calls me. Why would I want to call monsters? The hell? You wish to change your name, whatever do you mean? <laughs> okay. That's uh, slightly strange. Okay, so that feels like nothing. <laughs> uh, I kind of know where I'm meant to go because it's got the big ass crystal in front of it. So, you know, I kind of know where I'm going to go, but I also want to fully check out the area. Can I get... where can I land? Wait, where can I land? Wait. Wait. Now, do I have to land all the way over there to get into these places? Alright, let's just do this one first. Sorry about this, guys. Sorry, this is not that interesting. But, you know, I'm just like, I don't know where I'm going to be going. Oh, wait, I can't even get... Oh, for God's sake. Oh, I can't even get out that way. Uh, so I would have to park in here. I love how it's like I'll have to park. <laughs> I just have to park my massive airship. Uh, anything over here? Oh, it's... It's how quickly it changes from sort of one place to another. It's confusing. Oh, so if I park, can I actually park here? Wait, let me... I don't think it let me park. Aha! Yeah, but I don't think I can get out because of that rock. So where? 
Where the hell did you get in there then? So if we go there, I can probably get... Well, I can probably get in there. And then we'll see what that is. The Lunar Path. Okay, this feel, that feels like where I'm actually meant to be going, considering that is uh, got treasure chests in. So sorry, I'll have another quick fly around, and then if not, we'll end the episode there, guys, <clears throat> because I got to the moon. Uh, I can't get around that way. How do you get there? I don't understand. <clears throat> It's like the most confusing thing I've ever come across this. Ah, can I get to oh, I can't tell because there's no stairs down. I've <clears throat> been in there. Uh, yeah, up and down, up. And down. Oh, I'm getting uh, I've been in that one. So that's not where I want to get in. Uh, oh my god. Right, okay. Fine guys, I'm going to have to work out how to get in those other places if I can. So, thank you again for watching me play Final Fantasy IV Pixel Remaster. Sorry this is a fairly short one, but we got the Excalibur and we got the frying pan. <laughs> so that we could go see uh, Yang. We didn't quite save Yang, we did kind of save Yang. But thank you ever so much guys for watching me play. Please subscribe to the channel if you have not. And we'll be back for more Final Fantasy IV Pixel Remaster soon. Cheers guys.